take care of it. Just kind of bear with me here. So uh, if you don't know me, uh, my name is Amanda Williams. I am also known as Amanda the Traveling Realtor. And I think most of you are on this call because uh, you're in Daniel Penley's network, correct? Are you part of the master series or are you yes. part of his online training? Yes. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so uh, I've known Daniel now for, gosh, probably about 10, 15 years. And when I first learned about this company, I went to him, and this was three years ago, and I went to him and I said, Daniel, Daniel, you've got to see this new, this new real estate brokerage model. And um, this was when it was really new. I mean, there was only 3,000 agents in this firm. And so he was like, oh, that's really cute. <laughs> and um, three years later, uh, he has now decided to partner up with me on this and we are just having a ball. And so um, as you guys may or may not know, um, he did come out publicly last Friday to tell everyone that he is now a part of EXP. And so that was huge uh, because as you all know, Daniel has a, a very large network of agents that look up to him and that have been training with him for who knows how long, I mean, years and years and years. And so this is exciting. And the, I think what's most exciting about it is the fact that someone who's been in the business for so long, like Daniel, I mean, 43 years in this business as a real estate coach, he saw this opportunity and said, oh my gosh, like I can actually for one time in my life, pretty much have my firm but not have to be responsible for anything and get paid for this and, you know, love and support a group of agents and really build this thing to be really big. So it's really exciting. We're really excited about it. And um, I'm just going to go ahead and I'm just going to share my screen with you. What I'm planning to do today is I'm going to walk you through uh, a couple of slides from our PowerPoint presentation. And then I'm going to share my screen with you. I'm actually going to go in like behind the scenes into the back office, into our cloud office. And I'm going to show you all of that today. So first off, I'm just going to start sharing my screen. And if you guys have questions, be sure like if I don't see your chat, just open up your mic and just say, hey, I have a question. Okay, because I have no problems with stopping for questions or anything like that. So I'm going to start from here. Um, Glenn Sanford is the founder of our company, okay? Never call him the owner because uh, he will say no. We're all owners. Um, I'm just the founder. And so I really like that about Glenn. He's very um, humble, extremely humble. I will, I will definitely tell you that. And so he's been in business for a long, long time. He's really known as an innovator um, with, with anything technology. He's more of a tech guy. Um, but he's an amazing, amazing leader. So what's interesting about this time and this company, uh, we've been in business for 10 years. So it started in 2019. However, just in the past four or five years, it has really taken off. And I'll tell you why. If you look at my screen here, you see that um, innovation happens when a disruptor enters the industry. Well, Netflix was a disruptor. Netflix completely did away with Blockbuster. I think there's two Blockbusters left, like in the entire world right now. And that was a disruptor that came in, you know, oh, you're going to be able to order a movie from your TV. Yeah, right. Like, what are you talking about, right? Um, and now that's all we do. And so Amazon, same thing. You're going to be able to buy everything online. No one's going to be going to the store anymore. Oh my gosh, did we realize how much truth that there could be in that with all of us sitting in our home right now and not even able to go anywhere except for the grocery store or the doctor. And so we saw this happen before COVID-19. We saw Amazon taking over and brick and mortar locations completely closing. We've seen it happen with Toys R Us, Babies R Us, Pier One Import, Dress Barn. Um, there's a couple of Walmarts that went out. There's big box businesses that have completely gone out because of the Amazon takeover. And now here we are going into month two of a lot of these non-essential businesses have been like literally had, they just had to shut their doors. And we're seeing that as well with the real estate brokerages. I mean, we were already seeing it a little before this because the real estate brokerages, you know, especially the smaller independent firms or the franchise owners, it was very hard 
uh, to keep all of those bills paid, especially if a recession came or if something happened and not as many houses were being sold, that real estate broker or that franchisee owner is now stuck holding the back with all of these expenses. And I just talked to one of my girlfriends out. She's actually in California. She has 23 Remaxes and they had to shut the doors on all 23 of them. And she's like, this is going to kill us. You know, this is absolutely going to kill us because, you know, our agents are not able to go in and they're scared out of their mind right now. And so um, with what EXP is doing, there is not a, a physical location. OK, everything is in the cloud. And I'm actually going to take you into our office because there are some companies out there that call themselves like virtual companies where you can log in and like watch some videos. And that's cute. But we actually have like a real office with real employees in the office. And so if you have questions, you go right in, you get your questions answered, and we have over 500 employees. So it's super cool, and I'm gonna take you guys behind the scenes to see that. So I, I like the slide, uh, mostly because I love, Air I, I mean, I shouldn't say I love Airbnb right now because they treated the host very poorly lately, but uh, I have an Airbnb business as well. And I, I like to show this because it took Hilton 99 years to build a company that is valued at $18 billion. And Hilton is hurting right now. They've shut a lot of the hotels down. The, the expenses are still coming, you know, even though they're not bringing in that money, they're still gonna have to pay for the expenses, the mortgages, all of that on those properties. Well, look at Airbnb. Look what they built in the past 10 years. They're valued at $31 billion and they don't own a single piece of real estate. Let that sink in for you. And make the comparison here between the Hilton as the brick and mortar brokerages and the Airbnb as EXP's cloud-based brokerage. So what is a cloud-based brokerage? Well, number one, I already said there's no office, right, except for in the cloud. Um, so what that means for you is that there is no desk fees. You can work from literally anywhere in the world, any beach you want to work on. Uh, there, you're cutting out all of the brick and mortar costs, all of the expenses, leases, all expensive leases, all of that's gone. And yes, you have access to go into a real office if you choose. We've actually partnered with Regis. If you guys are not familiar with Regis, um, they're in every major city in the world, and you have access to go in and use their offices. It's a co-working space, and so it looks like this. Um, all of them look different, but they're all, you know, generally like this. And so you're working with other entrepreneurs. You're working with other, you know, it could be uh, engineers or marketing people or salespeople, just whatever, you know. Uh, you're able to work in here with them if you feel the need that you need to get out of your home office. <laughs> right now, I guess, I'm guessing we all kind of feel the need that we need to get out of our home office because we've been stuck here for a little bit. Um, so this is definitely open to anyone uh, within the company if you want to go out and maybe meet a client or do some work or just go have some coffee and, and network with other business professionals. And a lot of leads actually come from working in an environment like this versus going into a brick and mortar location. And everyone that you're there with is pretty much your competitor. Uh, you're all real estate agents or you're never going to get a deal from going into the office unless someone somehow refers you something, which they're probably going to take that themselves. So just something to think about. So I get, la I get asked a lot about lead gen and websites and EXP offers you, um, it's a CRM system and a lead generation system all put together. It's called KV Core and it's a phenomenal program. If you were to buy this, personally, uh, it's $1,000 to set up. And then it's between $300 and $500 per month um, just to use the system. And this is your CRM. It's your IDX Fed website. So it brings in all of the listings uh, of your current MLS into your website. It also gives you the ability to do squeeze, uh, squeeze pages and landing pages and all of that. And if you don't know what that is, um, we have other classes on that as well. We can teach you all about that. But that's, that's where you can build out pages and you can post it out to your social media and you can pull in leads directly to your website and then they directly get put into your CRM system 
with an automatic text and email campaign that goes out to them. So all of a sudden you have a client that texts you and say, Hey, Amanda, yeah, I do want to go see that house that you just sent me. And you're like, Oh, great. I'm in a meeting. I'll call you right back because you have to go research who that person was and what house you just sent them because it was actually the system doing the work for you because we're working smarter, not harder. So that is called KV as in Victor core. That is the name of the CRM system. So when it's normal life, uh, we love getting together. We love having events and we do a lot of trainings and a lot of conferences, um, leadership trainings, EXP tends to attract the entrepreneurial type agent that really uh, wants to build their business. They, they have big goals and big dreams and they see themselves creating an empire and, you know, building that for their family and not, you know, not just them, but their family and their kids and their grandkids. And it's just, it, it's a good, I, I'll tell you this. I'm from North Carolina. I grew up with a bunch of people that thought you just, you know, you graduate high school, you go to college, you get a good job, you get married, you have kids, you settle down, I got a good job, I should be happy, okay? And they never really have goals or dreams or anything like that. I left North Carolina when I was 21 years old because there was just something inside of me that was like, I want more, like, I want to build something big. And I moved to California and I spent nine amazing years in California. And what I found about California was I felt like it was the melting pot for everyone who had big dreams and big goals and aspirations. And they were just like, they were ready to go out there and just make things happen. And I was like, I finally found my people, right? Well, that's how I feel about eXp. I finally found my real estate people within this firm because the agents that you'll meet in this firm, they are all about helping each other. They're all about, you know, going big and building something big for your family. And so we like to get together. We like to have fun. We like to train each other. Uh, we like to share this model with other agents. If you put your business hat on with this and we just like helping each other because the more we all help each other grow this company, the more we all earn because I'll share with you in a little bit. We all own this company. This is a publicly traded company and they give us stock for doing things that you do anyway. So I'll get into that, but that's one of the main attractions to this company. So um, the live training aspect, it's really funny. It says 20 hours. We had 80 hours of training last week, and I'm gonna take you into our training calendar today and show you exactly what we have going on as far as training goes. Um, but on average, we have normally 50 to 80 hours of training every single week, and it is live and it's training on everything. It's on how to sell better, listings, buyers, uh, it's on mindset, it's on commercial, it's on investment property, Airbnb, um, how to get through this tough time. You know, We have a whole new series that just came out and it's all about how to pivot in this market and how to go digital, how to do everything virtual. And so I'll get into that as well when I show you um, exactly what the, what the training calendar looks like. So, this is our tools, okay? These are the tools in our tool belt. And EXP offers us a lot as agents. And the biggest thing is enterprise. So EXP Enterprise, and I'm going to take you here. This is the one-stop shop for you to see everything EXP. So I'm going to walk you in there um, here in a minute. And SkySlope is an online transaction management software system. And so all of our documents go in there. We have a whole transaction team that goes in. They make sure all of your T's are crossed, all of your I's are dotted. And therefore, when you finish that transaction, it's saved in SkySlope. And so you don't have to worry about having tons of filing cabinets. And if the commission comes after you in three years and says, remember Miss Debbie Penny's uh, file from three years ago when she bought a house on 123 Main Street? I need to see that. Well, you have everything here and you know without a doubt you are not going to have to worry about anything in that file because transaction department is not going to let anything slide. So they're not going to pay you until your file is complete, which I think is a really good thing because it holds us accountable and it holds us, um, you know, it, it really it saves our butt from the commission in case anything were to go wrong. Uh, so that's Skyslope. And then Workplace, I'll show you as well. 
uh, Facebook actually built this for us. Facebook was at our convention um, last October and they rolled this thing out and it's a place for all of us to go and communicate and share ideas and just share business with each other from all over the world. We're in four different countries right now. So I'm going to share my screen with you now and I'm going to go into um, exactly what that looks like. And first off, what I'm going to show you is I'm going to show you the training calendar. And if you have been on all of the other uh, classes that I've done with Daniel, I've mentioned in there that you can get a free pass into this training calendar. And it's good until the end of May. And this will give you um, a way that you'll be able to go in and literally take any classes that you want to take. So um, today is Friday. Today are, today are really slow days uh, in the office. That's the only classes that we have on Fridays. So I'm going to skip over here to Monday. So as you can see here, um, Monday, these are all Pacific time. So it starts at 6 a.m., all right, if you know anyone in Canada. And then all of these classes all day long are open to you, the agent. And so, and it, you don't have to be with our firm. You could be with any firm right now. We're actually, we've opened the doors and we're allowing anyone in until the end of May. We're allowing all agents to come in, brokers, agents, it doesn't matter what firm you're with. We just want you guys to get trained during this downtime. Because if our real, if all of the real estate agents in our community stay working and, and keep this market going, then it's just going to help our real estate market. Okay, we have to all like bound together during this time and just keep our market going and uh, tell our you know just tell our clients you know it's okay you can still buy <laughs> you can still sell it's a great time to sell actually and so um, as you can see here there's a lot of really cool classes. The Fast Start program, there are 13 of this, and these are more for agents that have just came on with us, and they are looking to just figure out and navigate the EXP life as an agent. And so the roadmap goes in, it kind of does an overview of everything um, that we offer, and you can pick and choose kind of like a menu as to what you actually want to use. And if you want to be a mentor, we teach you how to be a mentor. There, you can actually earn additional money if you're a mentor. So that's a really cool thing. And so getting into just trainings for all agents. Uh, goal setting for agents is amazing. Um, so you can take that. And any of these classes, like let's just say you're interested in this one, the Icon Series, Becoming Your Inner CEO. So anytime you click on here, it'll tell you when. So this one's on Monday morning at 9 a.m. And it's in the EXP University in the Icon Auditorium. So I'm going to show you where that is. And it tells you all about what you're going to learn in this class. And it tells you actually how to get in if you don't have a pass yet or if you're not already an agent with us. So like I said, if you want a pass, then let me know. We can, um, we can get that out to you. Amanda? Yes, ma'am. Um, is there any different meaning for the different color? like uh, green, red, blue? Good question. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. So anything in green is going to be our, um, I, don't, I, guess, I guess it's affiliate. We own a lot of these companies. So like Interland First Cloud is our, Interland's our mortgage department. So uh, when you're an agent with us, we can actually uh, invest into our mortgage department and we can bring on other mortgage officers and we actually make a dividend off of that. So we are investors in that as well. EXPI, which is the stock symbol, symbol for EXP Realty, um, we all own stock in that company. And so that company owns all of these companies. So we already own it, but like this just gives us an additional opportunity to invest in a mortgage company as well. So it's super cool. We have that with the mortgage. Uh, we have a, a title company that we've partnered up with. Um, we bought Verbella, which is, I'm going to show you what Verbella is. That's our office environment. So anything green is going to be one of our, um, I call it affiliated services. And we have, we have a few of those as well. Anything in red is going to be, um, I guess more for, uh, Canada and staff and stuff like that. Uh, it, the blue is normally what we go to. The blue is 
uh, all of the normal uh, training classes and, and world tours and all that. Now over here on the side, I don't know if you can see it, um, you see this where it has all of these states right here. So on the side over here, this is all of the, the state meetings. And if you're in California on Monday at 10 a.m., there's a new agent orientation class. And any agent that is coming in to EXP or very, you know, very considering it very hard, uh, I say go to this class. And it's an orientation. It just gives you a complete overview of everything. And um, it actually teaches you how to work your avatar and all kinds of stuff, which I'm gonna show you as well. And then on Tuesdays, um, California has their other meeting. We have a state meeting as well. And so the California state meeting is on Tuesday at 2 p.m. And that's where the broker in charge for the state, um, there's actually a lot of them, but you guys, most of you are thinker in LA. And so um, Deborah Penny is the broker in charge for that area. And I can show you how to get in touch with her as well. So that's what all of that is. All right, so I just wanted to show you that real quick. Um, I will send out an email and I'll show you exactly how to access this. But again, uh, you, can, you're, you can go to any of these classes. The Excel classes, uh, like right here, 10 ways to reach your sphere with KD Core. Um, that's a really good class. Like I said, Excel is for anything that has to do with this market right now. And I'm talking like now, like how do you pivot? How do you, what do you say to your clients at this point? You can't call them and say, hey, you wanna sell your house? <laughs> no, you have to build value. You have to come at them at, from, from a, loving, um, a loving place where you're gonna help them. And then if they need to sell their house, they know you're an agent, they're gonna bring that up. But at this point, you're just keeping that relationship going with them. So I wanted to show you that. And then also, um, I mentioned EXP Enterprise. This is our back office, okay? So after you're an agent with us, you have access to this, and this gives you everything that you need for EXP. This is you know, all of the information, the investor information. We are a public company, so EXP World Holdings, you can see all of the financials in here, the press releases. We have a charity organization. Uh, it's, it's for our agents, so we donate to it for certain things that we do throughout the year. And any of the agents that, um, that work with us, if anyone has something terrible happen, like uh, we had an agent have a house burned down, and uh, we helped her um, rebuild a house. So she, for some reason, insurance didn't kick in. So that was really cool. So that's, that's for, our, for our agents and our firm. And then um, SkySlope, these are all of your tools, like I was explaining. And ShareWorks, this will make a little bit more sense in a few minutes. This is where all of your stocks are. So it's by Morgan Stanley, uh, your owner in the firm when you're an agent with us. So you can come in here and you can see um, how much stock you have, what it's worth, and all that good stuff. And down here for the resources and education, the Explorer Guide's really cool. So this is what the Explorer Guide looks like. If you have any questions at all, like let's just say, um, you're like, well, Amanda mentioned that Regis thing. Like, what about that? And so all you got to type in is Regis, and then it's going to pop up right here. So this is all of the technology solutions, and you'll go all the way down here, and it just, it, it finds where it says Regis, okay? Well, they've added a lot to this. Here we go, Regis. So your Regis membership here. And so um, you would click here to get your application and you would just fill out your application and then you would get your Regis number. Same thing with BombBomb, Bomb, um, which is a, a video marketing type campaign. We just have a lot of partnerships with a lot of technology companies. So you'd be able to get some really good discounts with them. Amanda? Yeah. Hi. Hi. Um, so Regis or BombBomb, Bomb, do, is that all included in our monthly fee or is that an extra? Regis is free. Uh, well, it's included in your monthly fee. Mm -hmm. And um, Bomb Bomb is an extra. So it's that Bomb Bomb is just one of those companies that we've said, hey, um, we're gonna we're gonna send you a mass amount of agents if they wanna do that. So they give discounts. Um, so you still have to pay for Bomb yeah. Bomb. Um, same thing with like build a sign. So build a sign, they give you a 20% off and then sometimes they run specials of like 30 and 40% off for ordering your signs. 
-hmm. And so they just have a lot of partnerships like that. They have the same thing with some CE classes and all that stuff. And I know Daniel does CE as well. So you may already get your CE through him because I think he offers it from free. Since I'm asking a question, I, I, if, if I can quickly ask you about the yeah. Skyslope, <clears throat> because I have an account with Skyslope because my, my brokerage, current brokerage is affiliated. But if I move, that would be a separate account, right? So I won't have access to all the transactions I've done with my current brokerage. Correct. Um, oh. I don't know how they would handle that, to tell you the truth. Um, right. You would need to have some type of backup for the past three years of that. Yeah. Just in case. Uh, okay. but yeah, you would be starting over with a brand new Skyslope account because we keep all of our office docs in here as well. And mm -hmm. so um, anything that you need, uh, you know, EXP related is yeah. already going to be uploaded in. So I guess I can go to, because I know you can download all the files of the transactions you've done. So maybe that's the way to do it. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, you're very welcome. We can deep dive into that as well and, and see what the best option would be for you. Um, so yeah, so going through here, um, I did mention about the mentor program. Um, totally optional if you guys want to do that. I, I'm a mentor. I enjoy it. Um, you get an additional 10%. And, you know, it's not bad when an agent goes and sells a house. You get 10% for just looking over documents and just helping them and being there to, act, to answer questions for them. So I like that if you're looking for multiple streams of income, like I always am. And so um, there's a lot of stuff here. Uh, as far as marketing and branding, these are your links to order your signs. I will tell you this, um, when it comes to marketing and branding, you can either use everything that's already created for you. So all of this is templated out. So you've got you know, your flyers, your brochures, your social media posts that you can edit and you can put on your Facebook or your Instagram. You've got your logos, your signs, your business cards, um, postcards, door hangers, buyer and listing presentations. These are fantastic, by the way. Your letterhead, um, you know, your newsletters. If you're a blogger or if you want to be a blogger, <laughs> uh, blogs are really good. And this is a bunch of blog content and new and stories for your newsletters. So if you want to set that up through KV Core, through your website, and through your automatic messaging uh, campaign, this is all of your content. All you have to do is copy it and paste it directly into your blog, and boom. And you can change around some words if you want to, whatever you want. But that's your content. And I know that a lot of agents don't do that because they're like, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to write. Well, there it is. It's right there for you. So it's really cool. Uh, and then also we've got the helpful documents. We like doing like a trusted provider list and you can create your own list as well. Videos. We have videos as well. And guess whose information is at the back of that video? It's yours. Everything is personalized. So you can go in here and you can just put your information in and then they will uh, send you a download for your own personalized video that you can send out to your clients or to use for social media or whatever you want to do. And there's your newsletter templates as well. So, question. Is, uh -huh. I'm sorry. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> Thank you, Amanda. So does KV Core have uh, uh, like email campaign uh, platform in part of it? Yes. Absolutely. So, so you don't have to have like two separate database. No, right? it's KB Core is your CRM system and mm -hmm. your um, your lead generation system all put together into one. And mm -hmm. so, yes, uh, you can you can do all of that. And and the email email blast can be customized design wise. It's it's not like a bland design. It, it, you can make it as pretty as you want. <laughs> yeah, yeah absolutely, absolutely. So there's like, I don't know, there's hundreds of different um, like templates, automatic templates. Yeah. But you can go in, you can change them, you can customize them, you can create your own. Um, you can do whatever you want to. Okay. Yeah. And KV Core, when you get your, your account with KV Core, it takes about a week after you come on with us. But after you get your account, when you log in, there is an agent success guide. 
and you go through that and it's a series of videos, step-by-step -step videos that's gonna help you do all of that. So it's super cool. All right, now this is, this keeps doing this to me. I was gonna show you what the marketing center looked like, but honestly, I forgot my password. So I'm on my old computer today. <laughs> um, so we'll get into that, but you saw exactly what that has to do. And then the brand center, um, workplace is the last thing I'm going to show you before I get back over into the uh, stock and the revenue share part of it. Workplace is what I was talking about where I said it was built for us by Facebook. So as you can see, this looks like Facebook, right? Um, it's called Workplace. There's a news feed. You can be a part of any group that you want to. Uh, Whatever state you're in, you're going to be a part of that state group. So you guys, most of you guys would be a part of the California state group. And when you're on your, your news feed, um, you just, whatever groups that you're a part of, you're going to see all of the posts that they've done. Now, what I did earlier is I went to this EXP shareholder summit group because we had our shareholder summit scheduled for uh, April 20th through the 22nd down in Florida. We were all going to the Epic Center and it was just going to be like this, um, or Epcot Center. It was just going to be like this amazing experience for all of the shareholders, which are the agents in the company. And we had to cancel it, right? Well, we didn't. We didn't cancel. We ended up moving the date and we are having our shareholder summit with thousands of agents and um, get all the guys from, from the New York, from, from Wall Street, you know, all of the investors, they're all coming into our office and we're all gonna be in an auditorium, thousands of us, and we're gonna have our, our summit. So it's gonna be absolutely amazing. I, I just asked if we can invite guests in, so I'm waiting on an answer um, back for this. So I just, I just posted that, all right? And I'll tell you, I'll show you here. Um, so California, again, you know, you can go in, you can see exactly um, what's going on. So here's, oh, here's another event coming up. So this Saturday, um, this is an event that's coming up on Zoom and they go live on Saturdays at 12 o'clock on Facebook. Well, 12 o'clock Eastern time, 9 a.m. Pacific time. And let me tell you a little bit about this. And I'm, I'm gonna jump into our office here in a minute, but. Gene Frederick uh, owned seven uh, KW franchises. Actually, he owned a region in seven KW franchises. Rob Flick helped Gary Keller build Keller Williams when Keller Williams only had 1,200 agents, okay? Brent Gove ran one of the largest real estate teams in Sacramento, uh, doing over $200 million a year. Scott, Scott Lewis, again, ran a huge team. I think he's out of Texas. And now um, all of these guys right here all live in Puerto Rico, except for Brent. He has a family in Sacramento. Um, they all moved to Puerto Rico because of the tax savings down there. And so it's just, they have an amazing story. So if you guys are available Saturday morning, um, I'll, I'll give you more information about that. All right, so I'm gonna share with you my screen and I'm gonna show you our office. This is the most exciting thing. So this is what we call EXP World. And I actually went and set it a table um, because anytime you're inside of a blue circle, no one can hear you talk and you can't hear anyone else talk unless they are sitting inside of the blue circle. So this is literally our office, okay? Um, I'm getting around with my little arrows. And so I'm just gonna walk right, I'm not a very good walker, sorry. Um, so when you first come into the office, you actually get dropped into a dressing room. And after you dress yourself, um, you come out and you are here. All right. I've got my away symbol on, so you can't really see what anyone looks like. They're all like stick figures. <laughs> That's funny. Um, so when you come in, if you had questions or if you were lost or really didn't know where you wanted to go, let me take my away off of here. Um, set to normal view, okay. Um, so you could go up and you could talk to someone here and just ask them, um, you know, where do I need to go for so-and-so? So as you saw earlier that uh, one of the classes was, I believe, in the EXP University and it was in the Icon Auditorium. 
So in order to get to the classes, um, you would just go over here and you would click on whatever, like for instance, EXP University. We're gonna go into the Icon Auditorium right quick. So I'm gonna click on that. And this is gonna teleport me over to the auditorium. Now, if I wanted to walk all these places, then I could, it's gonna take me forever, um, but I could do that. But I just prefer doing this. So here, um, look at there, this is a class coming up. Uh, let's bring this in. So how to make an additional six figures selling condos. So if anyone's interested in that, um, this agent is going to be teaching a class on that. So that should be pretty interesting if you're in an area that, um, that has a lot of condos. So I'm gonna zoom back out here. So when you come into a training, um, it's just gonna dump you in here. You can have a seat when you hover over the little, the little chair. See that little sit down man? Uh, you click on it and you can sit here. You're gonna see someone on stage talking to you. This is a real life person. And if you click up here, it says zoom in. This will bring the PowerPoint to you like I just did, okay? There's a couple of ways to communicate when you're in here because like I said, these are live trainings. And so you can number one chat. This is the preferred way um, to communicate when you're in a large setting like this. So you'll just come right in and you can type in your questions. If you wanna talk, um, you can raise your hand. And then if, you're, if they tell you to open your mic, then you can actually just open your mic like this and everyone in the room would be able to hear me talk. So that is where you, that's how you take a class, okay? Um, now, the classes and the training are amazing. But what's more amazing, I think, is being able to get all of our questions answered like that. And so if I have an issue with, let's say, my computer and it's going crazy like my new computer just did a little while ago, that's why I'm on my old computer, then I can just click on go to and see where it says tech support. I'm gonna click on that and I'm gonna go to the lobby here. Now you can go to these other areas, but I'm just gonna go to the lobby because I like to speak to someone in person and I like to just go ahead and get my question answered. So. I'm, I like immediate gratification. So here we go. I've got to take all the stuff off my screen. Do you guys see all the chats and everything on my screen or do you just see my world app? You know what I'm saying? I don't see your chat. You don't see it? Okay, good. Cause it's like, <laughs> there's a lot of stuff on my screen. <laughs> all right. Um, so this is the tech support office. And if I had an issue, what I'm going to do is see where it says, please take a number. So I can just click right there and it's gonna give me a number. It's gonna actually put me on a wait list. Right now, there's one person in front of me. It's probably that Lucy May it was because she just went away and I went to number one. I'm gonna leave the wait list because I really don't want them to, uh, to teleport me into the office. So I'm gonna walk in here. And what happens whenever you have a question, and it's your turn to talk to someone. It's going to teleport you in. Do you see how the tech support manager is sitting here? And then there's someone sitting here. Lucy May is sitting there. So what they do is anytime you're in the blue circle, you have to think about this as you just walked into an office and shut the door. And no one besides you and the person in that office, or in this case, inside the blue circle, that's the only people that can hear your conversation. So you can turn your mic on, you can have a conversation, you can ask questions, you can ask stupid questions. It does not matter because only you and that one person can hear each other. So that's really cool. And this is not the only type of support that we have. We have accounting, we have payment processing, we have transaction de um, department, we have the uh, human resources, uh, agent healthcare. Guys, we're the only real estate brokers that offers agent healthcare. And I have it, and I think it's amazing. It's way cheaper than what I was paying. Um, all kinds of stuff. So I'm gonna show you one more thing in the office, and then I'm gonna get back over to our, to our um, PowerPoint. So where it says broker state rooms, this is really cool. When you click on that, obviously the map comes up, and you use this for two things. You can use this for getting in touch with your own broker, 
And if you have any questions or whatnot, you can go right into the office and talk to them. If you have an agent in a different state that you have referred to the company, then you can actually go in and you can meet them in their broker's office in Texas. You can meet them in there and you can sit and have a conversation with the agent that you're referring to the company and the broker in charge for Texas. So I'm gonna walk you in and I'm gonna show you um, what the California broker room looks like because this is where you would go, the majority of you, I know there's a few of you from other states as well, but the majority of you are from California. So I'm gonna show you the California room right now. And so when you first come in, um, there's gonna be an, a, a broker here managing this desk, and this is your reception desk. So again, think, I just walked into a brick and mortar location, there's a person at the reception desk, and they're gonna say, hi, how am I? How can I help you, all right? Hi, Amanda. There you go. <laughs> so let me just tell her what I'm doing so she doesn't think I'm being rude. Hey, Lisa, can you hear me okay? I don't think my speakers on this computer work. Hello? That's why I got it messed up. So I'm gonna say, Hello? Hey, my speakers do not work. I'm going to say just giving a office tour. Okay. There we go. Yeah, my speakers on this computer don't work. <laughs> so I just let her know that I'm just giving you guys an office tour. Um, but know that whenever you go in, they are going to greet you and they're just going to say, hi, how can they help you? And whatever question you have, they are going to um, send you into the appropriate person's office. So there's the support coordinator. There's about eight different brokers, I believe, for California. And um, like, see, Brian's in here. Brian's one of the brokers. He's at his office. So if it would, if I had had a question, um, she says, "Awesome. Well, come in. Let me know if you have any questions." Okay. So uh, if I had a question that Brian could answer, then she'd probably put me into Brian's office, and then I could sit and have a conversation with the broker. Does that make sense? How cool is this? Like, give me some feedback here. I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> I know that when I had a broker, it was very hard to get in touch with him because <laughs> he was super duper busy and it was leaving messages and text messages. And like, I had a question, I really needed that answer, but I only had one broker. And now you have multiple different brokers and you have a way to go in and get your questions answered like that. So, um, super cool. All right. You guys, if you want to grass pass, I can give you one. Feel free to come in here. You can go to any question. areas. Yes. Hi. Hi. Um, so California is quite large, obviously. And I guess one of the questions that I'm curious about is if I am doing sales in Los Angeles, is the broker going to be familiar with the areas that I'm working in and how, how savvy are they going to be with, with my, you know, my geography? Yep. So as soon as you come in and you talk to that receptionist, you're, if you're in LA, um, Debbie Penny is your main broker in charge. So um, Debbie and then Angela is kind of like her right hand person. So between Debbie, Angela, and then Brian helps a lot as well. Um, they all get everything signed. They get whatever you need done because it goes into one email account. Have that, a good weekend, Carrie. Let me walk over here. <laughs> that all of them um, actually handle so that it's not just one broker kind of manning, manning that whole email account. So, um, Debbie Penny's your girl. However, whatever questions you have, they're, they're going to find out where in California you are, and then you're going to be talking to that particular broker. But really, you know, if you need to talk to a local broker, you can, but California law is California law. So the reality is a lot of these um, brokers that are in California, they know a lot about the different areas because they work with agents from all over California because they man this office. And so they get all kinds of questions, but Debbie's your lady for, uh, for your local, for your local broker, if that makes sense. Okay. Can thanks. I have a habit of calling you Deb? All right. Because our other, our Deb Tabinski. I'm going to get out of here real quick. Deborah Tabinski likes to be called okay, Deb. So. so every time I see you, I'm like, hey, Deb. <laughs> all right. So there we go. Um, I'm actually going to exit out of here for right now just because when I have the world running on my computer it tends to make my computer run a little slower than normal especially when I'm on this old computer 
So now I'm going to just go back to, um, to the uh, presentation. And I'm just going to show you a couple more slides in regards to uh, the shareholders and the revenue share. So two things. Um, equity opportunities. I've touched on this a little bit. And so EXP is a publicly traded company. We went NASDAQ public in 2018, in May of 2018. When I first joined three years ago, we were pink slip public and the stock was trading at $2.42 um, before the, whatever you wanna call this that we're in right now. Uh, we were trading at around $11, $12, something like that. I haven't checked it today, but the last time I did check it, I think it was like eight or $9. So as you all know, all of the stocks have taken, taken a little bit of a hit. Um, but what I really like about the equity opportunity is they give you stock for doing what you already do. So every single year, whenever you close on your very first house, every year, they're gonna give you $200 worth of stock. So it just depends on what the stock is trading for, um, for that 30 day cycle that you closed your first transaction in, okay? So you're gonna get that. And then also when you fully cap, with EXP we have a $16,000 cap, so once you cap out, you then get 100% uh, of your, your, uh, your commission. However, they're gonna give you $400 worth of stock as well. So that's awesome. And then the third way is if you see this as an opportunity to build, like Daniel's doing, your, your brand within the brand, like your, your brokerage within the brokerage, and you refer other agents, we call it sponsoring other agents and building your tribe, then whenever that agent sells their very first house with us, then you're gonna get another $400 of stock just as a thank you for referring that agent. You're also gonna get a revenue share from that agent selling their first house. Um, actually, it, every house from that point forward, but um, this is just a thank you for referring someone to the company. So. Um, the Icon Agent Award here in the middle, an Icon Agent means that somebody capped out. So someone, an agent came in, they sold the five or 10 houses it took to, uh, to cap out at $16,000, which is on average between 2.7 and $3 million of real estate. If that's what you're selling every year, then you're going to cap out. And then after you cap, then if you sell 20 more houses on top of that, then you are considered an icon agent and you actually get back that entire $16,000 that you paid in, in stock. Is that clear? <laughs> you are now 100, you've been 100% commissioned this entire time. And in fact, you're over 100% commission because the company has given you stock for selling that first house. They've given you stock for fully capping and they've given you stock for other things as well. And you're over a hundred percent commission. So when, when an agent comes in and an agent is selling, I'd say between 25 and 30 houses, California numbers, um, a year, then you are, you're way over a hundred percent commission on this gig and, and you actually own something. So that's awesome. Um, the icon agent award is broken down. Uh, into $12,000 of that $16,000 is uh, held into what we call a three-year vest. So think about that as like your retirement plan, okay? Um, you can't touch that money for three years. So that along with the equity plan, which is the first three uh, areas here that you get stuck, that's all put into the three-year vesting period. The other $4,000 is released to you when you attend the two live conferences every year, which this year we're doing it live, but we're doing it in our office. Um, but what I, what I like, and I'm going to tell you the story. There was an agent that was uh, at one of our leadership events in last August. And she had capped out and she got her $16,000 of stock uh, three and a half years ago. And obviously she can't touch it for three years. It had been three years. And she looked and that $16,000 had turned into $146,000 and she cashed that money out and she paid off her home. I don't know what other company you can do that in. I don't even know what other stock you can do that in, 
but that's a huge success story. And she was on that stage crying because she now lives completely debt free in a home that's completely paid off. And it's all because of that $16,000. And when agents say, Oh, well, you can't touch it for three years. I think that's a good thing because us real estate agents tend to spend money, right? You get a $16,000 check. What are you going to do with it? Go buy a car, <laughs> go upgrade, go shopping. Like, you know, you're going to spend the money. Most of us don't have, you know, that uh, control over ourselves to go put that money in a retirement account. And that's really what you have to think about is this is a retirement account. So the third way to, uh, to get equity in the company is the agent equity program. And this is completely optional, but you have the option to allow them to keep 5% of every, um, of your commission of every transaction. And then you can purchase stock with that at a 10% discount. So they would take 5% of your commission and then they would purchase stock at a 10% discount. Now that is free to you to cash out anytime you want to cash out. There's no vesting on that or anything like that. So that's the, um, that's the three ways that you can earn stock in the company. Are there any questions in regards to that? Okay, let's get to, in my opinion, one of the most exciting things about this. So this is what we call the revenue share. And so EXP is very different from any other firm you have ever seen. And the reason for that is instead of EXP hiring a recruiter, they actually put that into all of the agents' hands. And so they said, look, if you're an agent with us and you go out and you tell a, a friend about our company and that friend ends up coming and joining our company, then we're going to give you a percentage of every house that agent sells until they cap out every single year until they stop selling real estate. All right. So what that looks like is this. Anyone that you personally refer to the company, they're going to give you three and a half percent of that agent's um, to So you're an 80-20 split. So out of that 20%, 3.5% of that 20% that the company is keeping, they're actually paying that back to you. So that's where the $2,800 comes from. Because after an agent caps out, then they're 100% commission. So the most you can ever make on any agent that you personally refer to the company is $2,800 per year. Is that clear? I can't see your faces. <laughs> Um, so that's for anyone that you personally refer. You can get paid on levels two through seven as well, but there's a requirement. There's a, there's a, a qualifying that you have to meet. So if you refer personally refer five agents to the company, then that's going to unlock your second level. So that means that anyone that I referred Sally and Sally referred Tom, any houses that Tom sells, I will, nail, I will now make $3,200, which is 4% of that 20% the company's keeping. I will make that every single year that he's selling houses. Now, this is considering if these agents are cappers, of course. So I'm going to go into that a little bit depth. Um, so as you can see, it goes seven levels. The way to get to uh, all seven levels is to personally attract or tell uh, 40 agents about the company. So let's just break it down. So this is a five year example. If you told five agents over the next 10 years, or excuse me, five years, <laughs> if, you, so if you told 10 agents over the next five years about the firm, and then they went and they told 10 agents, okay? So that would equivalent to about $348,000 a year if all of those agents are selling about $3 million a year in real estate. Honestly, it's not going to happen, and I'll tell you why. Um, a lot of agents don't do that. So each agent is really, I would say their, their worth, as far as passive income goes, about $1,000 per year. So in this example, I want to be very real with you. This example, this would be about $110,000 a year in passive income, and that's a real number, okay? And so. Um, I mean, I'm okay with $110,000 a year in passive income. So, uh, and this again is coming out of the company's pocket. This is not coming out of you or out of your pocket. And you are not required to tell anyone about this company. 
I've had agents come in and they're like, nope, I'm not, I'm not a recruiter. I'm not going to tell anyone. I'm not going to do that. You know, I'm getting hit up by all these EXP agents and I just have no interest in doing that. And I say, okay, that's fine. But you know what happens? Those agents come in and they are completely blown away at the support and the community that we have. And they end up telling agents and they end up building a passive income stream for themselves and for their family. And speaking of family, this goes down to your kids. If your kids get licensed, this will go to them when you pass. So when you're talking about building an empire and building a legacy for your family, this is it. If you choose to run this as a business and actually build your brand, your brokerage within this firm, you can partner up with them. It's, it's an amazing, uh, it's an amazing opportunity. So I uh, don't want to go drill that home too much, but if you are interested in the agent attraction aspect of it, let me know. Um, there's a lot of other stuff I can give you as well, just to kind of open your eyes a little bit more. All right. <clears throat> International collaboration, man, we've seen this over the past couple of weeks, big time. It, it's always been amazing to me that um, the agents are just so giving and they want to share because the more you sell, the more all of our agents sell, the more our company stock grows and we all own the stock. So we all want to help each other sell more houses. And so we have tons of masterminds and all kinds of stuff. And, and we're just there to help each other. It, it, you're not going to feel that competitive feeling um, between EXP agents. And I don't know how to explain it. You're just not going to feel it. And so there's a lot of masterminds and, and very powerful leadership events and trainings that we do together. And it's just, it's in the name of just helping each other grow. So We've been named the Amazon of real estate for good reason. Um, there's a lot of articles about us. You can look at all of them later. So this is the bones of the company. <clears throat> it's an 80-20 split. So 80% to you, 20% to the company until you cap at $16,000. After that, you go to 100% commission for the remainder of your anniversary year. Now your anniversary year is going to be uh, let's just say today's, I don't even know, the 15th maybe? I'm probably way wrong. Um, let's just say today's the 15th. So if you joined us today, then your anniversary date would be May 1st of 2021. So <clears throat> you would have until May of 2021 um, to cap out, to do all of that, and then your cap will reset. This does reset every, every single year on your anniversary year. Uh, <clears throat> standard cost here. It's $149 to start, and this includes your business cards, your folders, all that good stuff. It's $85 a month uh, because it's a $50 a month tech fee and a $35 a month university fee. I just tell people, look, it's 85 bucks a month. This includes everything. There's no other money out of your pocket, period, as far as a monthly fee, nothing. $85 a month, that pays for your electronic signature, your um, transaction management software, your website, your CRM system, your automatic messaging campaign. If you want a Ring Central 800 number, you can have that. Uh, I mean, the list goes on and on and on as to what this includes, but it's very easy to just say, hey, look, it's 85 bucks a month, that's it. There are two per transaction fees, and that is a broker review fee. So we do have our transaction department that uh, goes in and makes sure all the documents are correct. They do get paid $25 per file, okay? So that helps to pay them, that helps to pay our broker in charge because the broker in charge, they all make a salary, okay? They're not selling houses normally. They are, this is their job. They are in the office nine to five. They are right there for you. They're on chat on your phone. Uh, if you have any questions outside of normal business hours, they're there for you. And so they, they normally don't sell houses. That's they're 100% your broker. And uh, I think there's a lot of genius into that, by the way. So $25 a, uh, per transaction. And then there is a $40 per transaction. Uh, risk management is the same thing as your ENO insurance. I know a lot of you are paying this per year um, and you don't do that here. You pay that per transaction and that will cap out at $500 for the year. So you can be assured that you are never going to pay more than $500 a year in ENO insurance. And that's if you're capping out and you're 
uh, you know, you're selling a bunch of houses. So this is, the, uh huh. <laughs> Sorry. I have a lot of questions. Yeah. So on the commission, 16,000 cap is the $16,000 GCI on us or your share or the company's share. That's what the company is going to earn. So if you, if you sell $3 million in, uh, in gross selling, you know, uh, 3 million, then 20% of that would be $16,000. You know, okay. it's going to depend on percentages, right? It's going to depend on if you're listing at 5% or 6% or if you're a buyer's agent or listing agent, but it, it comes out to, if you sell between 2.7 and $3 million of real estate, then the company is going to earn $16,000. So that's coming out of your pocket. Okay. So then there's a italics below there. 250 cap transaction fee, once cap transaction fees total 5,000, then cap transaction fee is reduced to 75. What does that mean? Yes. So that means after you cap, instead of having these fees on the, the right hand side, the $25 okay. broker review and the $40 risk management, it goes yeah. to a straight 250 per transaction fee for 20 transactions. So that's going to hit that $5,000. And then after you hit that, that's going to initiate um, the Icon Agent Award, where you get that entire $16,000 back in stock. And then if you sell, uh, let's just say you capped at 10 houses, and then you sold an additional 20 houses. So now your Icon, so now anything from 30 houses on, because I have an agent here that sells 175 houses a year. So anything over 30 houses, then you're paying $75 per transaction. So it goes to a transaction fee per transaction versus a, a split because you're already at 100% commission. Does that make sense? Okay, I couldn't follow, but that's okay. <laughs> I'll figure that out. I want you to follow. So, so let's, say, uh, let's say you sell 50 houses a year, okay? So if, if you sold 50 houses, let's say it took you 10 houses to cap, meaning those 10 houses were equivalent to $3 million. Oh my gosh, that is so, five houses. You guys are in California. It, it's taken you guys five houses to cap. Yeah. No. It took, it took you 18 houses last year to cap, by the way. 18 houses. It takes y'all like three. So <laughs> let's, let's just say that uh, it took you five houses, okay? So five houses. You've paid into the company the $16,000 because mm -hmm. that's the 80-20 split, right? After that, you sold 20 more houses. You would pay a total of $5,000 because it's $250 per transaction after you cap. So you're 100% commission, but it's $250 per transaction for your next 20 transactions. I see. After that's done. I see that's going to flip on the icon agent. You're going to get your stock and then your per transaction fee goes down to $75 until your next year anniversary. I got it. Got it. Yeah. Or, yeah. yeah. Please <laughs> ask questions. Like if I'm not clear about something, let me know because that just helps me get better and it helps you become clear. And we all want to be clear on this. So, I have a question. Sure. I thanks Amanda. Um, so the 250 includes, is the broker review and the risk management fee. It sure does. Yes. Gotcha. Okay. That includes everything. Yep. Straight okay. 250. Something else I want to include because I know some of you are investors as I am. The company is very big about you um, buying investment properties and doing pretty much your own transactions. And so they give you, um, they call it three freebies a year. So uh, for three listings a year or three houses a year that you want to buy, then the company will only take $310. That's it. And you run everything through the company and you list it as a personal transaction. You personally have to be the buyer or the seller or your LLC that you can show that you have at least a 50% ownership in that LLC. And so I think that's really amazing because they, they know the, um, the value of long-term rentals, short-term rentals. I mean, owning real estate, the wealth, you know, how do you get wealth that you own real estate? And so um, they really want you to do that. And then also if you are a flipper and you're flipping, let's say 10 houses a year, all of them are in your name or your LLC's name, 
then the three could be considered personal. And then the other seven you could run through as um, just a minimum fee, which would be $565 to the company. You don't have to do that uh, at a 5% or a 6% or anything like that. You can just pay the, like, let's just say you're listing your houses. You can just pay the buyer's agent their 2.5 or 3% and then only pay EXP $565 to list your own properties. So that's an option as well. Is that clear? I usually don't tell people that until a little later, but I, I know a lot of you are investors on the call. So I just wanted to hit that a little bit. So that portion doesn't count towards to the, that means uh, if you are a flipper, you don't have to follow the $16,000 cap, commission and cap. The, 500, uh, so the $565 or the 310, that would go towards, um, because that is, that is what the company is making off you. So that would go towards your $16,000. Um, however, um, so ask me that one more time because I want to make sure I answer it very clearly. So let's say if I just want to be an investor, I don't want to like brokerage or be an agent to bring the buyer, seller, whatever. Um, does all my deal goes with this um, 310 and 565? Yes. So if you are, let's just say you're listing all of your properties, then um, it would either be the 310 or the 565 because you only get three three tens. Um, so yes, so that would be that would be the the minimum commission that EXP would charge, and that 565 would go towards your sixteen thousand dollar cap. Now you you would have to flip a lot of houses um, in order to hit the cap that way, but it's if you don't really. As most investors, they don't really concentrate on the cap or anything like that. They're just looking for a, a real estate brokerage that's going to support them in their investment uh, endeavors. And EXP does 100%. They support you. And so, does that does that answer that question? Yes. Great. Okay. Fantastic. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I've got almost 100 agents in um, in my group here in my tribe. And uh, I would say at least 50% of them uh, are investors and because that was my background. You know, I, I flipped, I had rental properties. I still do. Uh, I own an Airbnb business and we do all kinds of stuff. We do a lot of seller financing. So I'm uh, very creative when it comes to investment properties. Um, so that's just kind of what we've attracted into our, our tribe here. Um, so explosive growth. Oh gosh, over the last 12 months, we've had a 70% growth rate. Uh, we are up approaching 29,000 agents right now, and we were on track to hit 45,000 by the end of the year. <laughs> but now, since this crisis happened, this pandemic happened, um, a lot of agents are really taking a second look at this because they're like, oh, I can work from home or, you know, oh, I don't have to go into the office. Oh, I am paying this expensive office lease and I can't use my office. And so um, we are actually at this point on track to have 60,000 agents by the end of this year. And so it's just going crazy. Um, we are in the US, we are in Canada. Um, we just broke open uh, the UK and Australia and we are um, planning to go into Mexico next. Uh, we already are doing our EXP uh, presentations in Spanish in the office, and we already have our paperwork in Spanish, so that's coming. And then after that will be South Africa, and then there's a couple of other um, countries as well that's on the list, so super exciting growth. Uh, the first step is really just to uh, download an ICA agreement. We'll send that to you. We, uh, we have a website that we can send you and I'll, I'll get that over to you guys. So this is just, this is uh, some of our corporate people, actually just some of our leaders and other agents that have done really well in the company um, ringing the bell. We just rang the bell again uh, a couple months ago uh, in New York, so that was fun. So we do events all the time. I shared with you the shareholder summit. It was gonna be in Orlando, it's now gonna be online. I'll, I'll let you know if they're gonna allow guests in um, I'm hoping they do because this, our shareholder summit's amazing and I just cannot wait to see what they do in the cloud office. And then um, our May event got canceled, of course. Uh, however, this, um, not that one, uh, this one uh, is still on. And I am keeping every finger and toe I have crossed and I hope you do as well. 
we have Tony Robbins coming to this event with us in Dallas in August. He is our speaker. And this is our 2020 uh, leadership event. So this is for agents that are in the firm and you really want to be a leader. You either want to build your own real estate sales team or you want to build a revenue share team um, like, what, like what I built. You know, all of those hundred agents that are on my team, they're, I'm not liable for them. I don't do their accounting. Um, I, I, don't, I don't have to do anything. The company, can, the company does everything. But in reality, we have built something very special with World Cappers. And that's, the, that's what we go by. Um, that's our tribe. And so we are always doing events and, and masterminds. And we have our team calls. And we have you know, Thursday trainings. And I do um, these. I'm probably going to start doing these every Friday now where you can invite other agents in. And, um, and this is just, you know, this is the way to build the business and you're sharing something that's going to change somebody's life. And the more you get involved and the more you uh, surround yourself with other agents, the more you'll see that. So, um, if you, hopefully, uh, we'll still have this. And if you want to come, let us know. So that is what I have for you today. I'm going to stop my share here and just open this up, uh, again for some, some, final questions. And I'm sorry, I haven't been reading um, the chat and there's a lot here. Um, so if you guys just want to open your mic and just ask me the questions, that would be awesome. Yeah, Amanda, I post a question. Uh, can anyone join the workplace or is it just for the EXP agent only? It's only for EXP agents. Um, it's our, it's agents and it's corporate. And it's all of our broker in charges. And so any questions that you have, um, it's just internal. It's an internal way for all of us to communicate. And so, uh, yeah, that is only if you, if you are an active agent with us. And another question, um, let's say if I have a friend, uh, we kind of uh, want to do it as a team, is there a benefit? to do that or is it better to just have uh, each of us join uh, individually? So that would really depend on what your goals are. So if, if you wanted to join and create a, a sales team, an actual real estate sales team, you can do that. You can, you can brand yourself, you can, you can call it the, the Sharon Realty Group, right? And if you did that, then you could just put EXP at the very bottom of that, but you could brand yourself and then you could hire agents to work under your brand and you would make an additional 25% on top of all of those agent sales. So that's kind of another like higher level conversation. It can happen. Um, I think it's very, I think it's, it's good to, to partner with people to do something like that. Uh, or, if you're not looking to do that and you're just thinking, Hey, I want to come in with someone for the agent attraction part of it. That's going to be a little bit more difficult because that is a marriage that you can never divorce from. <laughs> like, <laughs> seriously, the, the money comes in and um, you're, you're forever going to be attached to that person and your kids will forever be attached to that person. So um, that's, a, that's kind of another conversation, but what I would do if I had a good friend coming in, um, one of you just go first and then the other, you, the other one would just be on the first line and then you guys work together to build both of your, um, your, your lines, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That is also one of my concerns. So how about the referral fee? If let's say I have some transaction um, that I got referral fee from other brokerage. Uh, does that, how does that count uh, as the commission and cap? Yes, it does count towards your cap. Absolutely. Yes. And, and the referral fees are the same. I don't know if you're asking percentage wise or not, but you know, normal 25, 30%, something like that. That's normally what we do. I know some of you in California do 50%. I don't know how y'all get away with that. That's awesome though. I wish I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> yep. All right. 
Uh, let's see, any other questions in here? Recording, yes, I am recording this. I need to absorb it better. Okay, yep, I, I will send that out as well. Actually, what I'll probably do is just put it on my YouTube channel and, um, and then I can just send that out to you guys. But speaking of recording, I'm gonna stop the recording.